Hey guys, what is up? It's No Help, and today I'm going to be kind of bringing one of those ramble sort of videos again. Um, so this is just kind of a question that some of my in real life friends have been asking me, um, because uh, I'm usually quite a bit of an RS3 player, which probably just going to get a bunch of dislikes for saying that. But um, yeah, I've been hopping on old school quite a bit lately, and it's pr pretty much my main game now. Like I'm pr just AFKing on RuneScape 3 on both the accounts right now <laughs> actually for probably the last month i've been like playing old school like way more and way more enjoying old school than rs3 and um i think it's just the iron man aspect and the progression aspect of old school is just a lot more challenging and a lot more uh what's that word i'm looking for a lot more uh, enjoyable because once you get something you just feel like you earned it a lot more than on RuneScape 3, you just do your daily spins, get 100k XP, do your fucking dailies and get like 500k XP, and it's just like, pretty much uh, getting a max cape on RuneScape 3 is starting the game, if that makes any sense, because everything else, everything people do on RuneScape 3 nowadays is past maxing, and um, it's not really how I like playing the game. My whole, my favorite part about playing RuneScape is the progression and towards getting 99s and towards maxing. Um, so yeah, I, I don't know what it is, it's just old school RuneScape. Uh, there's parts of it I do not like, obviously, but uh, most of it beats RuneScape 3 in so many other ways. Like the community, there's the way more players, there's so many different challenges, people things the uh, challenges that people are doing like swampletics and things like that tons of other ones and just the community seems a lot better and uh i don't know i i've like i like the challenge i like the grind i like doing things like uh i don't know i like banking xp and that's really why i'm liking iron man so much it's just really cool doing farm runs to train herb lore and stuff and not waiting for a dull xp to train it it just feels more rewarding anyways um people have been asking me are you gonna max your iron man um Probably, probably one day I will, honestly, I, they're making so many updates towards Iron Man right now, like this one, for example, the sandstone grinder, so I basically, right now, I'm getting all these sands, and, um, I could deposit them in the grinder, and it'll make buckets of sand for me to train crafting, which I don't see there a point in doing that on a main, because you, you lose money doing this method, because you need to spend money for the buckets of sand, but this is pretty much just for an Iron Man update, and they're doing a lot of updates like that on old school lately, my mic is completely in the wrong spot. Um, they're doing a lot of updates like that with Old School lately, and I, I just think it's awesome. I think it's really good for the game. And uh, I don't know. For maxing, I, I'm i going to just look at every single skill and pretty much see if it's possible to max. Now, I already have 399s on this account. I've had this account for probably well over... Probably getting on two years now, but I kind of quit it for like a year. Um... Certain skills uh, will just become over time. Like everyone has 99 fire making if you're an Iron Man. A lot of people do thieving as well for money. Um, but I already have like wood cutting out of the way, and wood cutting realistically is one of the slowest skills in the game. Um, I mean, not one of the slowest, but it's a lot slower than most. Um, I pretty much have fletching banked. I pretty much have cooking banked. If I don't do, uh, if I need a little bit of extra cooking XP, I could do minnows or something like that or even wines. Um, farming will just come over time, obviously. I've got tons and tons of bird's nests and seeds to open for that. I pretty much just do herb runs right now. Hunter, um, Hunter I really don't see a problem with either because of birdhouse runs, and then once I get like 90 or whatever, I could just easily get 99 from that way. Pretty much all of the, um, what do they call it, the collectors or the, uh, whatever they call that, the, yeah, the collecting skills, Pretty much there's no difference between main accounts and Iron Man for those. Besides for the fact that you're going to want to bank a lot more to save your XP or to save your things. Like for example with fishing, you wouldn't drop the fish. You need to save it to cook. Just things like that will be a bit slower. But for the most part, it's kind of the same. I would say Slayer is the same, but not really because you need to get all the supplies yourself. You need to get the food yourself. You need to get the armor yourself. So Slayer will be obviously a lot slower too. Um, the only ones that I can really see being difficult would be like runecrafting. Um, once I'm 77, it's fine, but getting that 77, that's a lot of pure essence. Probably I'll have to do some Zalra or something like that for runecrafting. Um, construction's another one that, 
I mean, over time with miscellanea, I could easily get it, and that's kind of how I'm going to do it. It's going to be one of my last skills as well, probably, to get 99 if I even decide to go for max. Um, yeah, so the one I'm working on right now is crafting. Um, I'd love to get that to be my next 99, but I kind of don't see that happening because it's pretty hard. I'm going to be needing to collect tons. I'm just heading for like 80 crafting right now for the glory and things like that. Um, yeah, so let's just go on one skill one by one. So we covered construction. It's just going to come over time. Hunter will come over time. I need to get 77 rune crafting, then that'll be easy. Slayer, like I said, it's just a little bit slower because I need to get the stuff myself. Farming will come over time. Fletching's banked. Magic. Okay, so for magic, um, honestly, magic will just honestly come from elking. Elking with Slayer elking with agility and i don't see myself bursting or anything that much for magic really also lots of the natures that i craft from rune crafting will just head in towards to magic so i don't see magic really being a problem considering i already almost have two mil magic xp and i really haven't grinded it at all i just did it for like a week to get the super glass make so i don't see magic really being a problem fire making's done crafting like i said i'm working on right now It'll be a big grind, but I don't see it being a problem. Prayer, on the other hand, that is one that I'm not sure if I will ever get 99 because the amount of dragons I'd have to kill or the amount of pest control I'd have to play, I'd probably go crazy. So prayer and construction will probably be my last couple if I do decide to go for maxing. Cooking, like I said, I have it banked pretty much. Um, thieving's done. Um, for range, um, I can see myself if I do get like 90 from, from 90 to 99 hunter at chins or something, I can see myself training range, uh, like, I guess it wouldn't be abyss, that's runescape 3, I guess it would be like the, the skeletons or whatever, I've never really done that, but I, I, I don't see it being a problem either, as well as just, if I do get a blowpipe one day on this account, there's 99 range, basically. But, uh, yeah, I don't see range being too much of a problem either. Like, I could go for 99 range. Fishing, it's a collector as well, so it's honestly pretty easy. I could just spend two weeks at barb fishing and get 99 if I wanted to. But I probably will do, honestly, like, minnows or monkfish or something like that. It'll be a lot slower. Another one a lot of Iron Men say is really pain is Herbler. I honestly don't see it being a pain because you can just do farming runs and Slayer. Um, I'm going to start using my bonus or my fucking bonus XP, my like lamps and quest rewards and stuff for prayer because I don't see Herbler honestly being that much of a pain. I mean, secondaries for sure are kind of annoying to collect, but Herbler is a really fast skill as well anyways. Um... Defense, Strength, and Melee are all the same. I'll probably get 95 plus on all of these just from doing Slayer. And uh, I could easily finish up um, Strength with Fishing or something like that. But uh, the Melees, you have Nightmare Zone and stuff as, as well if I don't get it through Slayer. But yeah, and the same with HP really. It'll just come through Slayer, Range, Magic, whatever. HP is just is not even really a skill. Agility is very much the same as a main account. It just is a long kind of a, a long grind to do agility. It just takes forever. But as with agility, I could do magic and stuff and kind of just do them both hand in hand, really do elk agility, stuff like that. And agility, once you hit 90, I heard it's like kind of AFK, like the, um, the RD course, it, that you don't have to pay too much attention to and it's like 60k an hour which i did like 30k an hour at wood cutting so like that won't be a problem i just have to pay a lot more attention um and then for smithing if i do mother load mining for most of my because i i don't see unless there's that amethyst or a new mining thing comes out i haven't really explored high level mining but if i do um uh what's it called mother load mining um I'm getting more XP than I was with woodcutting. I always look at it like that. I did, like, um, use to, like, 90, and then redwoods from 90 to 99 with a rune axe. So I was literally getting, like, 30, 35k XP an hour. Um, if I could do woodcutting, I could do any skill. <laughs> That's the way I look at it. Um, so, yeah, I could easily do mining at the mother load mine. Collect tons and tons of gold and stuff. I'll make a lot of money for elking and stuff with doing... Uh, mining as well and that will just cover smithing and if i need to i'll obviously just buy some more gold ores and things like that in the future if i needed to do um smithing so that pretty much covers all the skills i really 
I'm not heading for max. Um, I'm not like on the grind for max. What the fuck is this? A clue geode beginner. Okay, that's that's cool. I've never actually done a clue scroll on this account, um, which is kind of funny. But um, yeah, I, I really don't see maxing as really that much of a grind now because they're making uh, lots of great updates for Iron Man and lots of uh, great updates in general. But it will take a long time, and there's no double XP weekends, there's no bonus XP, and it's kind of a lot slower than Risky 3 in general. But I'm up for the challenge. I think I'm gonna eventually get max one day, just slowly and work on it and have fun with it as well. I don't want to burn out or anything, but certain ones like prayer and things may never happen. <laughs> but if uh, it's my last skill, I might go for it i might actually go for max on this account one day that would be really cool anyways thank you guys for watching this video and i will catch you in the next progress video see you later